I'm being thing. forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So. so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit enough. me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me in my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're sir, not criminals! Please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you saying right here? Oh, man. You guys really don't know what you're doing to my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to Denver, Colorado, where we find our frauditor, Little Chrissy, whining and crying that one of his buddies ratted him out snitched on him if you will oh you just can't trust anybody can you little chrissy well hey that man said he was a journalist and he needs his cell phone well i can understand that yeah a journalist without a cell phone hell oh, you imagine that well hey sit back watch and <laughs> enjoy we actually had a snitch in our own group, which is, uh, I thought was my friend. We were all feel betrayed by this individual yeah. um, who made a deal because he wanted his phone back, guys. He wanted his phone back so bad because they confiscated all of our stuff. I have my good camera. I have thousands of dollars worth of equipment that they confiscated, guys. Um, and we all want our phones back. But he he said, well, I need, I'm a journalist. I need my phone, stuff like that. Well, well we're getting a warrant for your phone, he said. And uh, we said, well, what if I just come down there? Well, maybe we give it to you today. So the individual is Ghost Rider. A lot of you might know Ghost Rider. Uh, he's done some audits with Johnny Five O. Um, he has like five thousand subscribers, so he's Johnny Five O's uh, moderator. I've heard of this guy before, but I never really followed him. I don't think I've posted any of his videos, but I'll keep a closer eye on him now. Uh, if he turns on his own kind, he must really be a winner not loser just like all the rest of them anyway let's carry on let's listen to little chrissy cry a little bit more and you know i just feel betrayed guys i i thought that he was our friend he went in there and told them that he would let them go through his phone and what they went through his phone and they took pictures of our entire group chat conversation our group text that we had with i mean originally there was like 50 people on those group group text messages and then we narrowed it down to like 15 people at the very end so there's lots of big time auditors out there guys that were involved in those group text messages that they all have now and his response was well they didn't get any incriminating information uh well first he said well i think they're trying to get you for conspiracy dma I'm like well thanks a lot man <laughs> and now you're helping them with that i mean he's like well there's nothing incriminating and it's true guys like we didn't break the law it's not illegal to organize a first amendment protected activity but the point is guys is that he betrayed us number one and number two they didn't know the vast majority of everyone the only people they knew was big sis and i that's it 
Little Chrissy, you sound paranoid. Are you paranoid that the man might have some of your valuable information that you were trying to keep secret? Look at little Chrissy here being kicked out of the Denver, Denver Metro Rail System. By the way, that's a woman on the right. She nearly kicked his behind. Ooh-wee, look how tiny he is. He's just a little baby boy, isn't he? Now they have everyone's phone number. So now they can do some investigation, find out who each individual is, and if they want to, they can try to get warrants for everyone now. He threw us all under the bus so we could get his phone back, guys. He didn't come to us. I, me and Regan take care of our people, okay? He didn't come to us. I need a phone. Maybe we could have helped him get a cheap phone to get him by until we can get that stuff back. I mean, we are we can make sure everyone got out of jail, guys. We're not leaving anyone in jail. Thanks, AFA um, and, and, and Regan for helping us with that too. But it's a, he's a snitch, guys. He's a snitch, and he can't be trusted, okay? And I, I feel backstabbed. I feel betrayed. Oh, poor little Chrissy. You feel betrayed. You feel like you were stabbed in the back. You're going to need a safe space. Oh, your mommy will bake some nice chocolate chip cookies for you and give you a glass of warm milk and your favorite teddy bear. You can rock yourself to sleep, you poor little thing, you. My goodness. Okay, so <clears throat> that is it. Um, and, you know, like I said, you know, now the police have everyone's phone number. And they can tie that to everyone's name. They can do an investigation. They're the police. And they, they can get warrants for everyone if they want. Um, you know, it's unfortunate, guys. It's, it's sad. Denver Metro Audits took that extra step and gave him yet another chance to own up behind the scenes and say, hey, yeah, okay, I fucked up. He wouldn't even do it. Well, there you have it, folks. When frauditors start to snitch on other frauditors, we know the end is near. Yeah, you just can't trust anybody, can you, little Chrissy? Not even your mama. Well, that's okay. At any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by. Mm-hmm. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. So many. You assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh. Yo, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh. That's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing, nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing, take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You go to jail? Go ahead, put Stop your hands on me. me bro. Put your hands on me. No reason I'm really, to have I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm gonna arrest you for trespassing in a minute. On public property? Yeah, we're asking you to leave and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, she's right in my face, guys. You, you just assaulted me, man. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, you to record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Salam yalla, hamdullah. Allahu Akbar. Hak nuikan da kra. Ula wala, papatai.